Hey, what's up, guys? So in this video, I'm going to tell you about a TV offer that came to me a couple months ago. Okay, so I can't specifically tell you the title of the show because I was made to sign non-disclosure forms agreeing not to talk about this. Um, so I don't want to have any legal issues. However, I'm going to tell you about it anyway without being specific. Uh, you guys should be able to figure out what it was. So basically, I was contacted by a producer of this television show. The show airs on A&E, and it's one of the highest rating, rated shows, and it has been on now for five seasons. And the basic premise of the show was that they wanted me to go into a jail undercover for one month. I'm sorry, two months. All right? So from that alone, you should be able to figure out what it was. Um, it's crazy because when they first contacted me, I remember thinking to myself that this could be something good for me and I'll probably, you know, go on the show if it's anything other than this particular show. And the reason being is that I can't lie under any capacity. I can't go undercover and pretend to be in jail for charges that I'm not actually charged with. And there's no way I'm going to do this. There's no way I'm going to provide information to uh, the sheriffs and the officers who run the jail. Impossible. There's no way I was going to do it. However, they did offer me some good money to do this. Um, ultimately, I don't think the show got picked up for the following season anyway, but I had to say no, you know, and these are the reasons why. I'm not a liar. I'm not going to go into no fucking jail pretending, and it's just not me. I, I, I can't do it. In my eyes, it's snitching, and I'll never, I'll never be that, no matter what, no matter how much fucking money they offered me, even if it was millions of dollars. Another concern I had was, was that no one in the jail would know that I was there undercover, except for a few of the officers, They're the sheriff's officers. So there are liability concerns. My first concern was, even if I did agree to go on the show. What if some shit happens in there where I get attacked and I'm forced to defend myself and, you know, somebody gets hurt? I'll end up with real street charges and do real time and I'll be the biggest fucking asshole ever for going on a TV show and ending up with years in prison, real prison time, because of it. So, again, another reason why I would never, ever do it. But if I did go on the show, I think it would have been real interesting. I think it would have been very high rated and I think that a lot of people would have enjoyed seeing me in jail. Um, my wife thought it was crazy also. She's, you know, just, I never expected that I'd be asked to do something like this. And all these years, I've always been of the mindset that there's no fucking way I'm going back to jail ever, no matter what. And here they are offering me this fucking money to do so. I also was not able to do it because of financial reasons. No matter how much they were paying me, I can't close my businesses and disappear for two months. You know, that, that there's, there's so much more money at stake in me leaving. The amount of money I would have lost would have surpassed the amount of money they would have paid me. Plus, I would have lost a lot of business, a lot of customers. So I, I couldn't do it for that reason either. But I thought I'd share with you guys, you know, that I was offered this thing, and it was a pretty big deal. It probably would have led to something greater for me, but again, I can't lie. That's ultimately what it came down to. I'm not a fucking liar. I'm not a snitch. I'm not a rat. There's no fucking way I'm going into a jail and revealing any information about any illegal activity that goes on in there. And there's no way I would have been able to be in there with other people and lie to them about who I was and about having these fake charges. I, I just couldn't do it. So if anything else comes up, TV, movie related, you know, if it's something that suits me and I could basically be myself, I would definitely do it if the money was right. You know, so don't get it wrong and think that I'm not open to the idea. I am willing to, but it's got to be the right thing. And in this case, it wasn't, it wasn't for me. I can't do it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll talk to you next time. Thanks.